bucket drumming equipment and parts lesson this lesson is about learning to identify our bucket drumming equipment and parts naming parts are important to learn because it helps us identify the specifics of what we want imagine if I said play that thing on that thing it would be difficult to know what I'm trying to communicate without taking a lot of guesses. However, if I said, play the center of the bucket with the stick, it would be much easier to understand. And that's why it's important to learn the names of our bucket drumming equipment and parts. Let's get right into it. You probably know what these are. Say it out loud if you think you do. If you said sticks, you are correct. Sticks are what we normally play the bucket with. What's a bucket, you say? Well, it looks like this. In bucket drumming, we flip it over and we drum on it. There are several types of buckets. In this lesson, we'll discuss the major two. Metal bucket and plastic bucket. They sound different from each other, but often have the same part names. For example, do you know what this part of the bucket is called? If you said center, you are correct. On most buckets, this is our lowest sound. Next to the center is the rim. This is the highest sound on the bucket. And the sound that is in between the two. That was just a teaser. Come on in and join us in the members area of the Bucket Drumming Online School for the full video. There's lessons and sheet music that ranges from complete beginner to more advanced. It's a lot of fun. Come on in and see for yourself.